Okay, I'm going to take a look at this 2019 CCM Spitfire. We're going to grab the camera and have a good close look around the bike for you. Okay, let's get a close look at this CCM. It is HPI clear, only one owner from new. So we'll start at the front, we'll work all the way around the bike, get a good close look at the condition of it. You can see it's really nice, this everything, lots of CNC, aluminium on it, carbon fibre, it's got carbon fibre all around the front here with the LED lights. And again, these really nice carbon fibre mud guard with the CNC holders on there. So let's get a look at the front front wheel on this side. You can see the tyres as well, they're like new. It's really low mileage this, I think it's done 12 miles. Really nice bike. It's got the uh, radiator guard on there. And the frames there. It's not a painted frame, it's got a, like a lacquer on it. So you can see the TIG welding on there. They're all done by hand these. Really nice, really nice work on that frame. It does have the 600cc Husqvarna engine in it, it's like a motocross engine, puts out 55 brake horsepower. And it's got the uh, brushed silver tank on it. And the full carbon fibre mud guard on there, carbon fibre side panels on it. It has got an Optimate lead on it as well. Looking at that, the air filter. The chain and sprocket. It's also got a carbon fibre guard underneath there, on the bottom. Really is a nice looking bike this. Again, it's got the carbon fibre mud hugger on the back. Mounted with the aluminium as well. carbon fibre chain guard there and again the number plate holder on the back there again it's all carbon fibre CNC aluminium what is nice as well on these is this is your your rear light that's built into the frame on that wrap round bar on it and again all carbon fibre underneath Looking at that rear shock as well. So let's get a look over the top of the tank, the seat in the tank. You can see there, limited edition number 109 of 250. Skunk works plate on it. Move over, get a look at it from the back. I'll we'll move round to the right hand side. Get looking at that back brake. Well, it's got the uh, twin exhausts on this. It is a single cylinder, but it's twin exhausts. Got the nice honeycomb mesh on the end of there. Let's get a look all the way across this side. Get looking at the shock there. Just move the bars round so you can see all of the tank. A little Spitfire there on the oil filler. Got the carbon guard on the rear master cylinder as well. This is where you'll see the upgrade. It's got the it's got the twin Brembo discs on this. They come standard just with the one on them. It's about a 900 quid upgrade that. So what we'll do now, we'll go and take a look up at the dash and the controls and I'll show you how to start this as well because it is keyless. Okay, let's have a look up at the controls. So you've got your front brake, your throttle on this side. And over on the other side, you've got your clutch, you've got your lights, 
your indicators and your horn. This little lever on there, that's a decompression lever. So it's to start it when it's cold, because it's basically it's a motocross engine, the Husqvarna engine. So when it is cold, pull this in uh, to start it, because it, it will have so much compression it'll struggle to start when it's cold. Um, then on your dash there you've got a fire button and a kill, which is basically, that's your start button, that's your kill button. And you can also see there is no actual key on there. So let me grab the key, fob. So that's what you get, a CCM fob, and the key there, which is just for the steering lock, so you can you can lock it. Now what you have to do, a lot of people have I've seen videos on this, and they, they say you just put it somewhere near your back, the back of it, you don't. It's basically there. So it's just there on the back, right in the middle of that stripe, and that turns the ignition on and off. So you click that there, as you see, ignition's gone on, so your back light's on. It's powered all your ignition as well on the, on the dash. So then when you start it, you hit the fire button to kill it. You hit the kill switch there. That's how you turn it on and off, because it will stay on. Um, and as you can see on the mileage there, it's done just 12 miles. Okay, let's start this up, listen to it run. And there you go. If you'd like any more photos or videos, anything you want to see in close-up, we can do that for you and send it to you over on WhatsApp. If you want to give Dawn or Dave a call on 0161 713 3219, they'll be happy to help you. Finance is available on this bike. We can also offer contactless free delivery anywhere in the mainland UK. There's also extended parts and labour warranty available and a 30-day money-back guarantee. You can visit us online at www.somanybikes.com or you can call us by phone on 0161 713 3219 or you could call into our showroom in Greater Manchester by appointment only during these Covid restrictions.